Hey guys, Jeff the Nature Guy here at Zoo Montana, and I want to show you one of our newest little animals. Look at this little guy. Can you see his little head popping out there? Now that is cute, and he's a baby, and he's young. His name is Steve the Leopard Gecko, and what a cutie. And leopard geckos are so cool and fun to watch. Now, first of all, the neat thing about them is the fact that they are actually found in the Middle East. We don't have many Middle East animals here at the zoo, but this is one of them. So they're found in places like Afghanistan, Pakistan, places like that. Now, in that area that they're found, of course, the Middle East, obviously you know it's very hot, very desert-like. So these guys are very well built for very hot locations, which is perfect being that he is a reptile. Now, when you look at geckos, they have very weird skin, almost amphibian-like, but they, of course, are reptiles, so that heat serves them very, very well. Now, a couple things about this guy when you look at him. First of all, all those spots on him. Now, this guy's young, but as he gets older, he's going to get more spots. Of course, those spots are what help him get the name Leopard Gecko, but on top of that, they're actually incredible hunters just like a leopard is. In fact, they stalk their prey just like a big cat would out in the jungle. And what's amazing is these guys, what they'll do is they'll find an animal like a cricket or a cockroach, something like that. They'll see it, they'll stalk it, and then when they're ready to pounce, their tail will go really fast and they jump on it and, of course, make the kill. Pretty amazing to watch hunt. Now, the other thing you're going to notice on this guy as I turn him around here is look at this big, giant, juicy, fat tail. Now that comes in really handy for this guy out in the desert because obviously in the desert sometimes food can be pretty scarce which means it's hard to find. So what they can do is they can store fat inside of this tail a lot like a camel stores fat in their hump. So what happens is when the uh, food is scarce these guys can actually feed off those fat reserves in the tail kind of a cool little uh, thing that keeps him nice and safe in the desert heat. Now, last but not least, you're going to notice he's got these big giant eyelids, movable eyelids, something you're not going to see many lizards be able to do, but he's got those big fancy ones, so don't be surprised if you see him winking at you when you're here at the zoo. And the other thing you're not going to see this guy do is climbing up walls. You know, most geckos have the ability to actually hang on to vertical surfaces with their feet. The gecko, the leopard gecko, one of the few geckos that cannot climb vertically up the wall. Kind of a cool thing to remember. So guys, until next time, I am Jeff the Nature Guy here at Zoo Montana with Steve the Leopard Gecko. We'll see you at the zoo.